Okay guys, before we get to fishing, I want to talk to you a bit about what I'm going to use up there at Bullard's Bar. I like to use these Polina Peak Performance Dodgers. They work very well. Uh, this one, orange one here, and the Chilean Sunrise is uh, very good. And I also like this one in the Pink Moon. They work very well for me up there. And I like these Polina Peak ones because where most of your Dodgers will do a back and forth thing like this, the, these Dodgers will go almost like a full 180. So they got a lot more performance to it. It's going to jerk your plug around more, give it more action. So uh, I highly suggest these. Now for my lures, I like to use the, um, it's one of my favorite ones. It's in the hot pink color. And this gold diver down is a very good lure. Sometimes it's really hot and sometimes it's really not. But I like to keep it around. And I also like this Lady M lure. It's been out for a few years. Most people uh, heard of it by now. And I also like to use uh, tuna right out of the can. This is packed in oil. And I also add a little bloody tuna to it. And I use the bait oil, not the uh, gel. The gel, you want to use that when you're just going to rub it right directly on a lure. If you want to mix it in with the oil, it's in the tuna. You just want to use the regular oil. And I also put a few drops of anise oil in there. That works very well. Mix it all together. You gonna know, open up this little hatch on these. Put a little tuna in there. Close it back up. Like that. Yeah. Okay, I also like this uh, Jolly Green Giant. It's the white shoe pig corn. It works very well. It seems to be the corn to use for kokanee. So make sure you get that. And then sometimes I'll add a little bloody tuna and anise right into the corn. But uh, that's pretty much it. I also, uh, maybe I should mention, I run like an 18 to 20 inch leader on here. I don't like to go any shorter than that with the Dodgers and these uh, cut plugs. Because the Dodgers are going to go back and forth. The cut plugs are turning around and around. So it makes them kind of... Do a little figure eight. It works for a good combination. Now I'd go a little shorter with them if you're going to use a like a hoochie, but I wouldn't go any shorter than 18 inches with the uh, cut plugs. So there you have it. So let's get to fishing. Yeah, Sacramento. Whoa. Oh, there's one. Oh, right. Right. Oh, you did. Surface. Just to the surface. Yeah. Okay. So, I can't believe he stayed on. You must have hooked him really oh, good. Oh, yeah, yeah. There you go. Hold him for a pick. Yeah. So, this is, uh, we're going to throw it back or what? Is it? No, they're all keepers. Oh, oh, oh. Nice. Nice. They don't, they don't get much bigger than that. Swinging them can be the best way to do yeah. it if you guys do it right. Okay. I, I, I don't know if you can do it right. <laughs> to be honest. <laughs> That's why I got the net out there. I think we're, we're at this is the net crew. But when you're bringing them into the net, what you want to do is just walk them right into the net. Walk them right into the net. Okay. Yeah. It's a coordination club we've never had before. So. Oh. That gal that I used to do videos with too. Yeah. You can walk them right in. They can do this little regret flipping. I yeah, don't worry about that. That's just leader from. Oh, here's one right here. Okay, now keep it tight. Keep it tight. There you go. We're working hard. We're hardly working. We're yeah. hardly working. <laughs> Come on. Tip up. Uh, uh, oh, oh man. Is he off? Oh, he's off. See? Yeah, far see away. He's jumping over there. He came up to the surface way back there. Yeah. He didn't stand much of a chance. Go 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 go
Okay, we're out here on Bullard's Bar for the first time this spring. We got a pretty good group of guys here. Got a few fish in the box. Lost a few. Probably gonna lose a few more. <laughs> <laughs> we're doing all right though. I'd say. So, uh, one thing though, I would like to ask you guys to be sure and uh, subscribe to my channel on YouTube, Rusty Grobs Guide Service. You got it. I need subscribers, I need them bad. I already got my hours to get monetized, but I don't have my subscribers yet. Get him, get him, get him. You gotta, oh, no, 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 easy. Easy? Yeah. You got to rip it right out of his mouth. Yeah, if it, if it pops off the clip, then you don't want to. Easy, not not too fast. Ah. Well, keep him coming, keep him coming. He's there. Keep him coming, keep him coming. Right to the net. Oh, easy. Oh. Hey. <laughs> Good job. Wow. Good size. We get into some good fish. Yeah. We'll get so much action. Sometimes I look up. We we didn't even fish at all. Four rods are in the boat. <laughs> Cool. Oh, see how barely you just had him? Yeah, wow. Tiny little piece in there. Just barely. <laughs> just Fact, barely see, held that. on, yeah. Wow. Right. Okay, here, Let's get your picture. Let's get a photo. Oh, perfect spoil. Oh, we got a fish over here. You guys playing around? Okay. I'll take it. <laughs> God dang, we're taking photos and we got fish. He's gonna, he's gonna be, he's close to this. Ah. Keep it down, keep it down, keep it down. Okay. okay, raise it up. Bring it right to him, right to me. Oh no, don't raise him up like that. No! Okay, we got him. Don't raise him up out of the water. <laughs> okay, okay. Yeah. I just wanted you to turn him to me, not bring him to me. <laughs> okay. We can work on the coordination. Here we go. See what I mean? We only got one rod in the water now. Yeah. Okay. Thank you, sir. Who's up next? Steve. Ray. Ray, you got the Ray. Sam, I watch, watch the one rod that we have in the water. <laughs> yes. <laughs> Get up the front and just jump off. Oh yeah, 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 yeah. Oh yes, yeah. baby, yes. <laughs> 